Hello, Internet friends. For the Independence Day weekend, I spent my time on the Oregon and Washington coast near the mouth of the Columbia River. And this is a coastal forest. I don't know what kind of bird that is. I think it might be a wren. Anyway, so this is what the forest used to look like when we had more forest around here. They're tearing it down to build. But it's still fairly green. Anyway, so if you ever wondered what the forest smells like, it smells dank. <laughs> it's not quite moldy or anything like that. Not quite musty, but just has a sort of a dank smell to it. Look at the owl. Isn't he a riot? Makes the weirdest sound. We were out there hiking around and we hear this sound like, what in the heck is that? There are some other birds that sound like screaming children. This one here, I don't know if he's uh, thinking about eating us or just posturing. It was a really cool thing to come across. So while I was out looking at the wildlife, I was also um, looking at the plant life. I picked up a couple of books. So after this uh, owl clip, I'll show you the books. All right, so this is Wild Berries of the Northwest. And this is Edible and Medicinal Plants of the West. So here I have what's called Salal. It has like a blue type of berry. This one's Oregon Grape. I did not find any to take any clippings to come bring home and sprout. I was really disappointed. I looked everywhere. This is a red huckleberry. This is a, oh, uh, gosh, it escapes me. Okay, this is a salmon berry. And this is a thimble berry. Gosh, I can't remember if this was the black cap raspberry or just a regular raspberry. Or no, I think this is the Himalayan, Himalayan raspberry and the other one's the black cap. Or this might be, I don't know. This is, um, I think, a rose hip or a rose. I got them kind of mixed up. Yeah, I think this was the rose, wild rose. I found a lot of these. This is a red elderberry, but unfortunately they're poisonous, so I didn't bring any home. And then I also found this one here. This one's poisonous. It's a black twinberry or something like that. Tons of that. Couldn't bring any of it home because it was poisonous. But anyway, I had a really good time on my vacation. Thanks for listening.